What's going on guys, my name is James Collects and if you're following me for the first time, I'm both a nerdy collector and an eBay reseller. Uh, the idea is that I go to charity shops and car boots in order to find things both to collect and to sell on. Uh, oh, this video, um, right, heat wave has continued, uh, although we had a little bit of rain. Um, it's now Friday evening, it's about half eight, and yeah, I'm not gonna lie, it's been a very long week work-wise. I'm absolutely shattered, no doubt I look it as well uh, and we didn't actually get a lot um, i went to at least one charity shop every single day as well um it was literally just as i was passing through um, as i was normally eating a sandwich uh but yeah not a great deal um we got the settlers of catalan board game uh paid 50 pence um so that'll be going on a seven day auction uh but i'm probably going to wait a little while because I've got so much coming up I don't want to have to deal with eBay so yeah uh, I would have thought it would still be sold by the time that you guys see this video but I'm... I don't quite know what happened there I think my phone just took a selfie which is really strange but 50p we also have a labyrinth the jewel um, again it was a 50p game uh, so it should be Another seven day auction um, is bound to, to make money on. Then, oh, we got myself a little Iron Man figure. It's legit, I'm gonna sneeze in a sec. <coughs> oh, that was nice. Uh, so that was 50 pence, I think, from the charity shop. Um, this is actually all from one charity shop as well. Um, then, got some games so we've got Tinkerbell and a DS that is to trade into CEX I think it's only two pound maybe four or three one of those three numbers uh, so that was a quid and then games for myself we have SNK versus Capcom Chaos on the PS2 a game I definitely don't have Capcom Fighting Jam and Hyper Street Fighter 2 I think I have this one I'm fairly sure I have this one, but the rest of them, I definitely don't. Uh, then we've got a load of DVDs where, um, I'm presuming this probably all came from one donator. Uh, I'd be very surprised if this was from multiple, but I'm just gonna sort of move it all around off camera. If I show you this, it's gonna be fun. I really hope I don't tip it all up, but we've got loads of WWF I think that is rather than WWE I don't know when did it change we got 2010-ish 2010 11 11 10 12 so might have been WWE but those were a pound for four DVDs so what I'm most likely going to do is split them up into I don't know weigh it I suppose because I'm still really lazy and I only use Royal Mail so I'll probably stick them into bundles of how many have I got 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 I reckon 15 might be too much in one I think that might be too heavy tens I think we're gonna put them into bundles of 10 um, so I might try and get all the money in the banks together um, elimination chambers all together and things like that uh, I think there's a little bit of value in them it's probably only worth about one or two pounds each so by the time I do them in bundles of 10 yeah we should be quids in it should be about 15 pound or so uh, per bundle and uh, maybe more if there's one in here that's worth slightly more money but I'm just have to go through and just check them all out um, and see what's occurring but that's it uh, literally nothing else oh tell you right uh, there's a few other bits uh, these were 50 pence each, but I'm going to be keeping these because so, they're not worth a great deal, but they're just quite cool. Uh, so we've got the Ghostbusters theme uh, from 1984, I think. 1984. And we've also got uh, Star Wars main title, London Symphony Orchestra, conducted by John Williams. But it's in a CBS sleeve, unfortunately. But again, it's quite cool. And... Uh, the Carpenters. Admittedly, it's not a song that I know. It's Goodbye and I Love You. Maybe I do know it. I don't know. 
but uh, my my parents loved the Carpenters, so it's it's music that I used to hear quite a lot growing up. Uh, and yeah, it's just a, a little piece of history, and it doesn't take up any room at all because it's only that thick. So yeah, that is it. Now that is all I bought. Um, I'm going to record another video after this that'll be going up way before this video goes up. Uh, basically about the Iron Man figure that I got refunded on, which is good. Um, so I thought I'd give people an update uh, because I know a lot of people in the same boat as me. So it should hopefully be a bit of encouragement of people to not give up and to keep on chasing those pesky people and to get your money back. But that is it from me. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe. And I will see you lovely lot in the next video. Good gaming and happy collecting. Adios.